Industrial activities are essential to modern life, but they often generate wastewater containing harmful pollutants. These pollutants can contaminate our environment if left untreated. Ozonation is a powerful treatment method that addresses this challenge. It uses ozone, a highly reactive form of oxygen, to break down pollutants and disinfect wastewater. This essay will explore the four key stages of ozonation in industrial wastewater treatment. Ozone generation, ozone injection, oxidation of pollutants and effluent polishing. Ozonation offers several advantages over traditional wastewater treatment methods. Firstly, ozone is highly effective at eliminating a wide range of pollutants, including those resistant to other treatments. Secondly, it rapidly disinfects water by killing harmful bacteria and viruses. Finally, ozonation is environmentally friendly as it does not produce harmful byproducts unlike some chemical treatments. The ozonation process, while complex, can be broken down into manageable steps. Understanding each stage is crucial for appreciating the effectiveness of ozonation in treating industrial wastewater and ensuring its safe release back into the environment. The first stage in the ozonation process involves generating ozone gas. This is typically achieved using a specialized device called an ozone generator, which utilizes the principle of electrical discharge. Dry air or oxygen is passed through a high voltage electrical discharge field within the generator. The electrical discharge provides the energy needed to split some of the oxygen molecules, O2, in the air into individual oxygen atoms, O. These highly reactive oxygen atoms then combine with other oxygen molecules to form ozone, O3. The generated ozone gas with its characteristic pungent odor is then ready for the next stage of the treatment process. Once ozone gas is produced, the next crucial step is introducing it to the wastewater. This stage is called ozone injection and aims to dissolve the ozone gas into the water effectively. The most common method involves bubbling ozone gas through the wastewater stream. As the ozone bubbles rise through the water column, the ozone dissolves into the wastewater. The efficiency of ozone dissolution depends on factors like bubble size, contact time and water temperature. Finer bubbles and longer contact times generally lead to better ozone dissolution. With ozone dissolved in the wastewater, the oxidation stage begins. Ozone is a powerful oxidizing agent, meaning it readily reacts with and breaks down organic pollutants and harmful microbes present in the wastewater. This reactivity stems from ozone's unstable three oxygen structure. When ozone encounters pollutants, it either directly breaks down their chemical bonds through a process called direct oxidation or produces highly reactive free radicals that attack and degrade the contaminants indirectly. This process effectively neutralizes a wide array of pollutants, including pesticides, pharmaceuticals, dyes and pathogens. While ozonation effectively removes most pollutants, a final step called effluent polishing is often necessary. This stage removes any residual ozone and byproducts from the treated wastewater before it is released back into the environment. Effluent polishing may involve methods such as activated carbon filtration or biological treatment. These methods ensure that the treated water meets regulatory standards and minimizes the risk of environmental harm. Ozonation, therefore, plays a crucial role in the sustainable management of industrial wastewater. By breaking down harmful pollutants and disinfecting the water, ozonation helps protect our ecosystems and public health. As industries worldwide seek more effective and environmentally friendly treatment solutions, ozonation stands out as a powerful technology for safeguarding our water resources.